that was atrocious. That was truly terrifying, and I would not blame any fan in the city of Detroit if they came down to Ford Field this evening and just toilet papered the entire stadium. That was unacceptable. What was it like seeing all those fans dressed up as Matt Patricia? Yeah, they say imitation is the sincerest form of flattery. I gotta disagree. I'm not that fat. That being said, best looking crowd I've seen all year long. Are you trick-or-treating? If so, what are you gonna be? Yeah, yeah, I will be going out trick-or-treating with my kids this Wednesday. Uh, haven't decided on a costume. Some things I think I could pass as are a, uh, a before picture, a homeless guy off a fresh dumpster dive, um, the portly wizard from Harry Potter, or a defensive genius. I think I could pull all those off. Yeah, Coach, can you comment on how your defense played? Yeah, from a defensive standpoint, that was difficult to watch. Uh, I think the Fords make a truck uh, the same way they make a defense. Poorly. Please do not tell Mrs. Ford, but uh, I've always been a Chevy man. You know, F-150 ain't pulling in those awards from J.D. Power and Associates year after year. How about the performance of Tease Tabor? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Tease had a tough one today. The Seahawks picked on him from start to finish. Uh, and I think we're going to continue that trend tomorrow in meetings. We're going to sit down and we're going to play a game as a team. It's going to be called Teasing Tease because he played like a dumpster fire and he needs to know it. Any updates on Ziggy Ansa? Yeah, definitely could use some more difference makers out there. I am uh, reminded of some scripture. Uh, the Ansas you seek are found when you get Ziggy with it on the field. That's the book of Ezekiel, 94. Snacks. Yeah, the trade deadline was approaching and we had to make a move to fix our 30th ranked rush defense. I uh, actually I'll never forget. I was sitting on my couch and my wife reached over, grabbed into my beard and said, baby, you always do a little bit better when you have some snacks. So I ate the Dorito that she pulled out of my beard and I got on the phone and I was like, Bob, get me snacks, Harrison. All right. Is that it? Got to text Coach Belichick. Uh, He's telling me I'm not good enough, and uh, <laughs> I love you too, Dad. All right. Uh, is that it? Okay. Thanks, guys.